The Lady Lions lacrosse team is in the driver's seat of the WILA after defeating Regis University 15-12 Sunday. LU has a two-game lead in the conference standing with four games to play. Regis had a lead for the majority of the game. It was Jordan Constance who scored off a Regis turnover to give the Lady Lions a two-goal lead late in the game. They would then add an empty net goal for their final tally. Two players were responsible for two-thirds of the LU goals as Kara Cashin had six goals, while freshman Lindsey Palmer had four. Shorter University fell to the men's lacrosse team 15-7 Sunday at Hunter Stadium. At the end of the first quarter, Shorter appeared to have a firm grip on the game, leading 4-1. LU then outscored the Hawks 14-3 over the final three quarters. Andrew Zapan had, jo had Josh Aris led LU in scoring, each netting three goals apiece. Dan Ashlock made six saves and was the winning goaltender. Lennonwood is now 6-5 on the season. They will play their final WILA conference game of the season this coming Wednesday versus Adams State. Lennonwood baseball won arguably its biggest game of the season last Thursday, knocking off the number four ranked University of Central Missouri on the road. What may have been even more surprising is that LU then earned a four-game split with the Mules, stealing a second game Sunday. Sunday's 5-3 win saw starting pitcher Brian Ruby pick up the victory. He allowed three runs on seven hits in five and two-thirds innings of work. Senior Ryan Griffin picked up an 11-out save. LU will be home this coming Sunday when they take on Robert Morris Springfield. This fall, Lindenwood will become a full NCAA member, and it's been announced that its sister school, LU Belleville, will be joining the NAIA. The announcement was made this past week at the NAIA National Convention. For its first three years of existence, Lindenwood Belleville competed as a member of the United States College Athletic Association. They will now follow in the footsteps of Lindenwood's main campus, which competed as a member of the NAIA for more than 40 years. Back to you, Brittany and Madison.